Okay, I got Kailani here, the keeper. Back from Oahu, I guess. Yeah, I just got back last night. Um, I was very impressed with your uh, what your performance at the contest you did. You did. Oh, thank you. Um, <laughs> the, um, what, are you trying to get uh, on the on the tour? No. Um, what, what, what is your goal? Right if now. You have one. Yeah. I mean, the goal is to surf really good waves with no one out. Yeah. Always. Yeah, I love it. I love it. And then, second goal would be get into the triple crown. Okay. Then you can surf more perfect waves with no one out. Yeah. And on top of it all, I love competing. Yeah. It's like something I love to do because I feel like I get better as an athlete, as a surfer. So if I keep competing, I'll only get better and uh, that's fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. And my I, sponsors like it too. And I like to do good for my sponsors because oh, they do so good for me. Of course. Uh, I didn't see the, inter the interference you got. Well, how was that? Oh, it was funny because I was riding much bigger boards than everyone else. Yeah. And, uh, I basically caught a wave from uh, way out the back. Uh -huh. so I didn't have priority, but uh -huh. it was like, I was gonna get a 9.5 on it. Yeah. It was just that kind of wave. Yeah. And uh, uh, one of the guys dropped in uh, after I did my first turn. Yeah. Who had, but I ordered it. Who had priorities, but I kicked out. And for whatever reason, they gave me an interference even though I didn't interfere with him. It was really weird, but uh, anyway, it shouldn't have been an interference in my call, but yeah. uh, Stuff that's happens. why I didn't make it. And I mean, lesson learned. Yeah. Um, just gotta. But I'm gonna go back on that point I made before, because I think I would love to see you do the WQS and yeah. try to qualify. Maybe I don't know, maybe like next year or something. Because I think even though that night might be your main specialty at the moment. Man, you learn so quick, it's amazing. I think you, you have chances. Yeah, and I think the, the coolest part too is that, you know, surfing, if you just, if you do a little more surfing, maybe yeah. a little less of everything else, or if I do, yeah. it really still benefits my other sports. Absolutely. You know, it's it's been cool, because like with my windsurfing, um, I've been focusing on my big wave riding, and yeah. then, you know, doing a little more other sports, and not as much as I used to windsurf, but I haven't ever windsurfed better, made everything and sometimes it takes stepping away and then coming back and you're all of a sudden fresh and better so um, never gonna quit doing any of them but sometimes for a couple years one might take more priority than the other um, but it's all in the name of getting to that one point when you can master all of them and still very very far away from that but that's the goal uh, as a multi-discipline um, um, lover myself I totally agree with what you just said and uh, I love that you say you can't you're never gonna master those things I think I'll be able to get close one day yeah I'm only 24 and I, th I feel like in 20 years maybe I'll be where I think I can be but that's why I do these sports is because uh, you know, I can never master them yeah so it's literally like it's always going to be the same challenge and the same fun if you choose it to be that way. I love it. And you know, the kids after me are going to be doing stuff that I love you know, I can't even imagine probably right now. Um, so yeah. yeah. What's a rough <laughs> estimate of the number of waves you have caught since you were born? I have no idea, and it would be. Throw me a number. I would say in the millions. Uh, I love it. I agree with you, and so. I would say millions because what you should. You could count the swells I've ridden out at yeah. sea. Stand of course, up, of course, um, of course. Floor, everything, and, everything counts. You know, I don't know. By the end of my life, it's probably gonna be a couple billion, <laughs> and that's pretty cool. I mean, yeah. I never really thought of that statistic till you mentioned it. Yeah, now I'm gonna make you count the waves <laughs> for the rest of your life. Uh, Kai, thank you so much for your time. I thank slow you. you down too much already, and you have fun out there. Yeah, it looks good for aerials right now, and been doing a lot of turns and barrels on Oahu so it's gonna be fun to, to just focus on another you know facet of surfing thank you again thanks <laughs>